Hey guys, Malice here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. In the last episode, we made it to Cinnabar Island and we took on Blaine, the Cinnabar Island, Cinnabar Island gym leader. And then, in between the last episode and this episode, I trained up my team to level 5th, most, most than 50. And also, I did the Bill optional side quest um, off camera, so I do not want you guys to see that. Because we're not supposed to go there until after we beat the Elite Four, but... This is our team right now. Aroga, Aroga level 50. She has Aerial Waste, Stealing, Feather Dance, and Fly. Uh, and then we have Terra that has Stomp, Dig, Strength, and Horn Drill. Horn Drill. And then we have Miss Froggy, Brick Brick, Metronome, Surf, and Body Slam. And Duke, Flamethrower, Fire Blast, Bite, and Extreme Speed. And then Zeus. Thunder, Agility, Thunderbolt, and Rain Dance. Oh wait, got Dory. Then Dory. Solar Beam, Cut, Gidrain, and Toxic. That's our team for, 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 all, for all the rest of the game. Well, I guess it's time to fly back to Viridian City. Take on the last gym leader of the game. Ah. It's good good memories here. Hoopstitch. Gym leader, where are you? No. Wrong way. Gym leader, where are you? I'm here to take you on. I'm here to absolutely destroy you. There he is. Who are you? Green gym leader pretend. I gotta go from the other side. Okay. Well, we're gonna put this froggy up and then Dory. Let's see how this goes. Okay, here we go. Let's take this guy out. Roy, I'm making myself into rage. Working myself into it. Sorry, I didn't read that. Right. Need something to drink. Okay. Black Bell Tushi. I thought she. You got him a chop. Okay. Okay. Hey, um. Miss Brown, you sir. Uh, let's see if this. Let's see how good this does. Uh. Okay. 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 That did pretty good. Let me bring that next. You got him a choke? Let's bring out, let's bring out Aroga, Aroga, okay. She knows, so he moves. Let's use Aerial Waste. We got this. So, I have been playing around with a lot of games. I've been trying out the, the um, Dragon Quest games. Like I said in the last episode, I want to do the dra Dragon Quest games. I'm really excited. I just I started playing Dragon Quest 8 Journey of the Cursed King for the 3DS. I have the PS2 version, but I really wanted to play the um, 3DS version to see how good it is. I think I'm sorry. Who trained Yuji like that? Okay. Sand Slash. And I seen a Sand Slash. Okay. So let's take out these trainers. That should be it. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good, Miss Froggy. Oh yeah, yeah. A grappler, that's the evolved form of Geodude. Is it a girl or a boy? Get the boy. Use the fact of Cuddy use either Brick Break or Surf. This might have... Nope, he didn't have Sturdy. He did not have Sturdy, okay. So, the future of my channel will do will be a lot. We're gonna do Pokemon for one spin-off and one main game per year. So next year we'll probably be doing Pokemon XD, maybe XD Gale Darkness, maybe one of the Mystery Dungeon games, but also know Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver will either be, I might do, I might wait a year or two to do that, because that's a really big game, I might wait until 2025 to do it, and just do, go through a lot of games in between that. I might do a lot of spin-offs before I get Pokemon Heart Gold Silver. I, I know I want to do 
one of the mystery dungeons or XD Gale of Darkness. Because I absolutely enjoyed Pokemon Coliseum, to be honest. It was a fun game. I ran out of gas! Will I do more SpongeBob games in the future? Um, there are a couple I want to do still, like Revenge of the Flying Dutchman, which is not everybody's cup of tea. I also want to do Future Square, and I will be doing a Let's Play of Pokemon The Cosmic Shake. But one by the Cosmic Shake for the PS4. Not, I'm not gonna stream that game anymore. I don't know if I'm gonna continue Kingdom Hearts or just restart it. I'll probably continue it after I make a new save file. Because I, I lost all my save file on it. On Kingdom Hearts, to be honest. But that does not mean I not does not mean I'm done with the series. I love Kingdom Hearts. I probably need to turn turn down the music so I don't get copyrighted. Like the first episode of Final Fantasy VII got copyrighted because of some of the music. So from there on, I turned down the music, as you guys have figured out, and I haven't got copyright since. That does not really bother me. I listen to music when I'm not recording. That's just how it is. I have played a lot. I haven't played much of Kingdom Hearts, but I've played up to Birth by Sleep. Kingdom Hearts 3, I know most of the story. I really enjoy the world in Kingdom Hearts 3. Monster Tank World, Toy Story World, um, Tangled World is pretty cool, even though I wasn't really a big fan of Tangled, but that's okay. Kingdom Hearts is an odd series. It's um, Disney and Final Fantasy characters, mainly Disney. Not many Final Fantasy characters, just mainly Disney. But that's the kind of games I love to play. RPGs, JRPGs. Um, ground, poison, ground and poison type. Mino, 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 a ground and poison type, right? Yeah. So it's Mid Arena, so I have. That's what you said. So I will be doing Kingdom Hearts, I'll do Dragon Quest. I'll continue playing Final Fantasy, definitely. When, when I get to play Plus back, which hopefully this video is being recorded on Thursday, June 1st, this will come out June 5th, Monday, June 5th. Hopefully by Thursday, June, June 9th, no wait. Thursday, June 8th, I will hopefully have PlayStation Plus back, so I as soon as I get PlayStation Plus back, we will continue doing Kingdom Hearts. I mean, um, Final Fantasy. We will continue doing Final Fantasy. And... If... If I can get PlayStation Plus back, if I can get my save file, if I can get going with playing Kingdom Hearts again, I might continue that project real soon. Who knows? We'll see what happens. Do I know my next let's play? To be honest, after this I know my next let's play. Possibly. But I'm saving a Let's Play to start in September that I'm really, really hyped for. It's a GameCube game that came out in 2003. But I'm saving it for September because it will be its 20th anniversary. If you, can, if you guys figure out what game that is, I hope you guys will figure out. It's a very popular game that a lot of the fans wanted to see a remaster slash remake of it. I don't know why it hasn't happened yet. It's a great game. Fruity and Jim was close for a long time, but now our leader's back. I feel like the game deserves a 
modern adaptation. Just like SpongeBob's current friends thought Pink Bottom Rehydrated did for about Pink Bottom. I believe it needs an adaptation. Okay. Oh yeah, after this I'm gonna cut and go back to the Pokemon Center and heal up Holly World. I don't have very much surf left. He is mainly a ground type gym leader. Which is really cool. Okay, come on. I'm about to be level 54 by the end of this. Oh my god. Am I gonna be level 54 by the end of this? Maybe. I hope my commentary has gotten better since I started doing YouTube again. My first let's play was um It was now Kingdom Rehydrated, and I think I did really good on that game. I did 100%. I really enjoyed it. I really, really enjoyed doing Mouse Kingdom Rehydrated. It was so fun. Mouse Kingdom Bomb is honestly one of my favorite games. And I am so glad. Uh, I'm so glad Kichi Nordic got the opportunity to do a basically full-on sequel to that game, SpongeBob SquarePants to Cosmic Shake, because Cosmic Shake is my favorite SpongeBob game of all time. It's the best SpongeBob game of all time. That's my opinion. It's so freaking good. Um, I will probably do. I want to do Elden Ring at some point, but not for a long time. Oh, I'm gonna do a cut. I'll see you back, guys. I'll see you right at the gym leader in a few seconds. See you guys. I'm back, guys. Here we are. To face Giovanni, I put out, I put Dory out front because I think Dory deserves more, more of the spotlight. This gym for a little, for a little bit of gym battle. Ha <laughs> ha! Welcome to my hideout. It shall be so until I can restore Team Rocket to its former glory. But you have found me again, so be it. This time, I'm not holding back. Once more, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Malik versus Giovanni, the Viridian City Gym Leader, the last gym leader of Pokemon from the Kanto region. That's exactly what I thought he'd give you. Send out Rhyhorn. And we're gonna use Giga Drain. This should take care. This should take care of it. Yep. Good job, Good job Dory. Good job. Give me a lot of experience. Who's who's next? A Doug Trio. Yeah, let's use. Let's keep using um Dory. Giga Drain. Doug Trio looks sinister in this game. I've always, I've always had, a, had a theory that. Gary's father, well, Joshua in this game, is he the son of Giovanni? I've always, I've always had that theory. A lot of people have had that theory that the, the, the rival in this game is the son of Giovanni. I don't know if that's true or not. Maybe it's a, maybe it's true. It's a theory. Okay, we're gonna be low 54. Okay. Good job, Miss Froggy. Miss Froggy is doing great. Nino King. Okay. You sir, this should take him out. Hopefully. Good job, Miss Froggy. Good job. And his ace in the hole. Uh, is that Rhyhorn or Rhydon? Go Dory? Okay. I thought he was supposed to have a ride on. Well, guess we can use Giga Drain. To maybe take him out on one shot. Yep. Okay, that battle was not that hard. And maybe I over leveled. Maybe I overtrained my team. There we go. We defeated Giovanni, the last dream leader of the game. I'll be right back, guys. Sorry about that, guys. I had to take care of something. As I was saying, we defeated Giovanni, the final gym leader of the game. 
His bad, his, his bad wasn't that hard. Ha uh -huh. that was a truly intense fight. You have won. As proof, here's the Earth badge. Da -da 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 -da. We have done it. We have got the Earth badge. Okay, here we go. 5,000, that's good money. The Earth badge is Pokemon of any level obey without question. It's evidence of your master as a Pokemon trainer. With it, you can challenge the Pokemon League. Also, take this Tino. Consider a gift for your Pokemon League challenge. Can 26, Earthquake. Can 26, contains an Earthquake. It is a powerful attack that causes a massive tremor. I made it when I ran the gym here far too long ago. Okay. Well, we are gonna actually teach Terra Earthquake. Yes, he does. And we're, we're gonna get rid of... We're gonna get rid of Dig. We put Earthquake in. Okay. Well, this is a very short episode, but now... We're gonna... We're gonna take a trip. We're gonna take a trip back home. Back to where it all started. The nostalgia. Uh, we made it home, guys. Pallet Town. Mom, I got all eight badges. Yes, I need a quick rest. I got all eight badges, Mom. I'm going to take on the Pokemon League. First, I'm going to, I'm going to go see what Professor Oak is doing right now. Professor Oak, I got all eight badges. Good to see you. How is your Pokedex coming along? Here, let me take a look. The amount of progress you made on your Pokedex is 116 Pokemon seen, 24 Pokemon owned. Your Pokedex can use a bit more volume still. Try to catch other species of Pokemon. What did you just do? What did you just do? Well, I think it's time. Not the battle of freaking Rakata level like four, three. Come on, girl. Come on, Phoenix. Get on, get on my lap again. Yeah, my, my kid was trying to get in my lap. Uh, I know we have to... Where's the Pokemon we got? Be right back, guys. We have made it to where we needed to be. Ah, <sighs> Route 22. Ah, uh, it's been a while since we've been... Gosh dang it! We put more pills. Nice use our money back. Repel, please. Give Joshua. What now? What surprise to see you here? So you're going to be, so you're going to Pokemon League. You collect all the badges too. That's cool. Then I'll whip you, Malik, as a warm up for the Pokemon League. Come on, Joshua. Malik versus Joshua. Our rival. Okay. What do you got? You got a Pidgeot. Not a good matchup to start. Okay. Let's use this. You still have wing attack? That's what I thought. Pidgeot. Okay, let's do this. Well, let me use Thunderbolt. Okay. Did not expect that. That quick attack? Did not expect the quick attack. Okay, that should take out his piggy off. Yep. What else does he have? Does he have does, I know he has Charizard. He has that Charizard now. Okay. Rhyhorn. Now, we can bring out Dory. He's Goofy Drain! Okay. We've come a long way. Our Pokemon have come a long way. Our little Dory has come so long. Long ways. 
from a little Bulbasaur into an Ivysaur, now all the way to a Venusaur. Now she's level 52. He's level 52. Um, Alakazam. And this is where Duke comes along. Comes in. Duke has been through some tough times. He's been through some hard times. But he has persevered and became an Arcanine. Let's use Bite. Okay. He can use Calm Mind, which could be a problem if I can take him down with a Bite. First shot, maybe? Nope. I thought he was going to say we'll bite again, but thank you. Thank you, Lord. We took out his Alexander, which he was the major problem. Who's next? A Gyarados. Okay. Okay. Let's go with this. Ah. Ah. Who's faster? Okay. Gyarados is a pretty formidable, formidable opponent, in my opinion. Okay, we took him down. <laughs> Who's next? Execute. It is a grass. Why do we have Executor? I thought he would have a Executor by now. Well, it's what it is. I thought he would, but I guess not. Here's what it is. Maybe we'll have it in the next time we battle. Teammate, guys. Okay, guys, sorry about that. Cat's knocking stuff down. Charizard. Let's bring out Zeus. Zeus, one more time. That is not what I wanted you to do. This might kill Zeus, this might kill Zeus, he might- Nope, rain down. Do I have a do I have a- Okay, I'll pull the store. Okay, I'll pull the store. Slash, that's good, that's good, that's good. And if I hit, this thunderbolt will hit. This thunder will hit. You suck. Woo! That crit almost got me. You are a fire flying type. Yes! We took on, we took out Joshua! Ah, oh, we defeated Joshua. What? I was just careless. You. I know it. That loosened me up. I'm ready for the Pokemon League. Malch, need more practice. But hey, you know what? I'm out of here. Smell ya. Uh, okay. Well? We've made it, guys. Oh, that's the Boulder Badge. Go right ahead. Thank you. You can pass your own if you have the Cascade back. Oh, that's Cascade back. Okay. And, Thunder Badge. Yep. We got the Rainbow Badge, which was Koga's Badge? Yes. I think it was Koga's Badge. We got the Soul Badge. We got the Soul Badge. That was Sabrina. That was Sabrina's badge, right? I think so. Okay. You can pass it only if you get the Marsh badge. That might have been Koga's. I think it might have been Koga's. You can only pass it if you have the Volcano badge, which we do. That was Blaine's badge. Oh, wrong way. Okay. You can only pass here. If you have the Earth Badge. Yes, we do. We have all the badges. We have every badge. Okay. 
this is where I'm in the episode, guys. In the next episode, we're going to take on Victory Road. And possibly take on the Elite F No, I think we're going to do an entire Victory Road and then take on the Elite Four and Champion in another video separately. Until then, Malik signing out. Later, folks.